Say hi, Alex. Say hi. <laughs> yeah. What's up? <laughs> We're at the park right now. And look at my big girl swinging all by herself. Go, Nana, and back. And up, yeah. Good job, Ariana. Soon you could touch the sky. <laughs> Woohoo! Look at you, Nana. Do you know how to get down now? Are you sure? <laughs> Careful. Look at you. You go to school and play in the playground, and next thing you know, you're like an expert at playing <laughs> in the playground. Is this the park that you go to with your friends, Ariana? Yeah. yeah. Be careful, eh? Yeah. Like, is this stuff that you do while mommy and daddy are not there? Is this what your friends are teaching you to climb? Yeah. 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 See, I told you, I seen her jump, like, it was like from, like, here. I seen her jump from, like, here to the ground or something. Hey, I used to yeah, I know, but you're a boy. Oh my goodness, Ariana, you're gonna give me a heart attack. <laughs> I swear she never used to do this stuff before. This is so weird. I go on that side. Well, I think because she was with her friends, it made them made her feel a lot more comfortable. Go, Nana, go. Okay, so we just went to take some pictures too. That's why we're at the park today. Ariana gets some, uh, what's it called? Um, yeah, people send her stuff to wear and she has to take pictures of it. So um, we got the package in yesterday, so that's why we came today to take some pictures. It's a little bit cold now, but she took some pictures with her daddy, so that's why daddy's all dressed up and stuff. Okay, go. Woohoo! <laughs> Mommy? Yeah. Those are in my work. Yeah, they do. Go, Nana, go. It's probably really cold, huh? It's just. I'm not. In this one. Catch this one. Yeah. Yeah. No? You could do it. Yeah. You're almost there. Almost one more. Yeah. One more. Good job. Uh, Careful. Go. Push your buddy. I, I, I go okay, and then we're going, okay? Okay, but then we're going. Poor baby Alex is sick. Oh, poor baby. Baby Lala. <laughs> We're going to go get our tires rotated, so let's go. <coughs> the guy came to get our internet cables and stuff, so we are without internet now. <laughs> Alright, so we got a little story to tell you. Because... You... You guys. It was so stressful for the both of us. So oh my god, you don't even you understand, man. Anyways. <laughs> Sorry, I was sleepy and she woke me up and I took some. Uh, I don't know if you guys know what the fisherman's friend is. It's like the candy, it tastes like cherry and it's very. It takes away all the, the sickness, like sore throat. And all that. Anyways, I took that so now I'm all boost, boosted up, man. Anyways. So Amira, she woke up, it was like 7 in the morning, you know, dropped Ariana off to school. And uh, today we're supposed to be expecting a call from uh, the moving company to come pick up our stuff tomorrow. Right? As we said, Saturday's the day that we're going back. No, we actually never said a date. We didn't? We told them a date, no. We just said before the 31st. She and me. All right. By the time they watch this, it's probably going to be... When we're at Winnipeg, so. Anyways, 
Um, yeah, so then I, I open my phone, you know, it's like 7.30 in the morning, I, go, I wake up to go to take a shower when the mirror leaves. So we like to wake up early. Anyways, um, I go on my phone, first thing I do is check my emails, I don't know why, I checked my emails just in case something bad happened, and guess what, it did. Um, apparently the company's truck broke down. On the day before they're supposed to come pick up our stuff. Yeah, the day, yeah, exactly, so the day that they're coming to pick up our stuff, their truck breaks down somehow. Apparently, they're located in Alberta. I'm guessing it's Edmonton, but I don't know why, you know, they would leave a day before to come to Lloyd Messer, but it's a two-hour drive from Edmonton to Lloyd. It's kind of messed up, but anyways, they, yeah, so they, they said they can't pick up our stuff on tomorrow, Saturday, and now... They were saying Wednesday they could come pick up our stuff, but it was an exclusive truck, and they were trying to charge us like two thousand six hundred dollars. We were our set price was at a thousand three hundred, and they're trying to charge us like a thousand three hundred dollars on top of that. Yeah, so it's a it's total. It came up to like two thousand six hundred dollars and blah blah blah. Anyways, uh, yeah. So now we're gonna have to leave our stuff here and wait a week, and then they're gonna come pick it up on Friday of next week so that's gonna be what the 20th uh no the 30th they're gonna come pick up our stuff and we are leaving tomorrow yeah so hopefully their truck doesn't break down again uh, and then Actually, gonna... I'll go this way. yeah so anyways yeah then it's a big story where we're supposed to run some errands all day and ended up staying at home until i don't know what 11 o'clock yeah, yeah until 11 o'clock to actually Try and, and see if we could get another thing. company or this or that. Oh my gosh, hectic from 7 in the morning till 11 30 p.m. Yeah, uh, it was really stress, stress, um, stressing because we had everything figured out. Like, we were gonna leave tomorrow, and then uh, the reason we we're gonna leave tomorrow was first off because we told Ariane we were gonna leave tomorrow, and Ariane's been counting down the days. For 10 days now and she knows that we're supposed to go tomorrow and we wanted to get there before my mom's birthday which was on the 29th so no matter what we really had to leave today so it was really frustrating at the time but we got it all sorted out yeah we just had to tell you guys that so part. right now we're at the store i'll uh, probably get a vlog later a little bit later so alex thinks he's already back in toronto because he Starts like yelling outside and shit like that. <laughs> what? <laughs> We're going to the pizza store because we have nothing to eat left at home. Well, we do, but nothing to eat for dinner. So we're gonna have some friends coming over tonight. Not to party. Why are you saying it like we're gonna party? <laughs> we have some friends that are like um, good friends. Yeah, some good friends. One of our friends are taking our fish tank, and then. The and the other one's taking like lamps and plates. plates and dishes and stuff like that so we don't have to bring it with us. And then the other one is coming to say bye. Well, they're all coming they're to all say bye. Yeah. But don't worry, there won't be any partying. <laughs> How do you want us to party when we're leaving tomorrow morning at like 4? Yeah, I know. It's not smart. Okay. Oh, no. shit. I was, no, don't go. Don't Look go. Look at her, bud. Oh, she's letting us go. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> So we're going to the pizza store. We've never tried this pizza before, so never. hopefully it's good. Normally we Apparently. get like, uh, I don't know where all of you guys are from, but if you guys are from Canada, nope. some places have okay. Panagos. Huh? Panagos are like handmade pizzas and everything is nice and fresh. You see them bake it and shit like, oh shit. Why did I say shit like that? Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm talking Toronto shit, shit. slang. <laughs> We're, at <laughs> We're at Menchie's. Um, you get to like pick your own uh, frozen yogurts over there. They have a bunch of different flavors and then you have the stations over there to put the toppings that you want. Alex got, what'd you get? Peach orange. Peach sorbet. Peach orange sorbet. He always gets the fruity kind. fruity kind, and I always get the sweet kinds minus cake batter, <laughs> sprinkles, Chocolate, coconut, vanilla. and candy. 
making him swear so no. much no, no, is no, those we'll videos see. that we just started watching. Who are they? The Fochus twins? What? Get out of here. They swear every two seconds on their videos and Alex started like watching every single one of their videos. The Hush twins. Yeah. These guys are so funny. Though. Doesn't mean that you're going to start swearing in our... I know. It's funny. What's so funny about it? I hilarious. You're hilarious. Listen, man. <laughs> your shit. <laughs> no, Look, man. they have smiley faces on them. <laughs> so look what I just went and picked up. It's Kiki's paw print. In the back. It says her name and how old she was. Just went to pick it up because um, we were supposed to get it like such a long time ago. But, um, I don't, I mean like the lady that does this, she does it at home. And when I went to go pick it up, I asked her why it took so long and she says because she does baby hand prints and baby footprints and stuff like that. So she has a lot of orders to do. But it was nice to finally get this before we go back to Toronto. Hey guys, so I just wanted to show you guys um, we're leaving in the morning at like 4 in the morning and I'm driving first. So this is what our room looks like. I jam packed it with everything. Um, what's happening is the Czech people are coming to pick up our stuff on the Friday because they messed us over, like we said. And uh, we are leaving tomorrow. So my baby is really sad. Because our friends just came over and they just left. And you're sad because you're not going to see them again? Mm -hmm. yeah. She really likes daddy's friends. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to go to bed now. We have a long drive in the morning.